Pro Plaster was uh, a dream of mine. I was originally a plasterboard distributor, uh, and in those days when we were selling plasterboard, um, the sundries or the compounds and extras rode on the top of the truck and were delivered to site. And I thought to myself then that it was a standalone business. What makes us different in the industry is the range of products that we have. Um, and our customers tell us it's our customer service. Without customer feedback, we wouldn't carry the range we currently do. When we're introducing a new uh, compound into the market, we'll go out to the customers, spend time with them, get their feedback, document their feedback, and that gives us uh, a really good idea on what sort of product we need to introduce into the market. So I started my life as a plastering contractor, um, and I have been a plastering contractor and still am to this day and age. I mean, I think it's part of my DNA. And certainly, you know, the business skills that I learned from being a contractor and the cut and thrust of contracting um, helped me when I started to uh, either do plasterboard distribution or today with the Apply Plaster products. In the beginning, um, we were all about innovation. And the products that were being sold in the US were certainly innovative in terms of the way that they were manufactured, the way they were packaged, etc. So we realised as we started to grow the business that for us to be able to grow organically that we needed to be manufacturing our own compounds. And so we started that process, we put a plant together and started to manufacture. And what that allowed us to do was to be able to then grow our business because we could make it and manufacture it at will, um, which for us was better. Um, it gave us more flexibility um, and it also gave us the opportunity then to tweak the product for the Australian market. So one of the other unique features that we offer as a manufacturer now is the opportunity to do private label for customers. Uh, and we've done that very successfully for some uh, well-noted companies such as uh, Hume Plasterboard, uh, Betterboard uh, and DPO. The motivation behind the online stores, I suppose, we are, we've always been innovative in what we do, um, an industry leader as such, even though we are a small company. Um, the way that we do things is completely different to all the large corporates out there uh, in the, the plasterboard market. What we found when we first started with the online store, it was very much just about tools. Um, what we're doing now is more about uh, customer information, uh, industry information, um, helping customers understand about the products. Rather than just sort of showing what the products are, we're, we're delving more into what they're about and how they can help them. Uh, another facet of the business is so that we're uh, starting to make our way into uh, the export market uh, and we have a very strong and building market for us in New Zealand where we sell our label products and we also do a private label. Um, once again, this allows us to sell uh, multiple brands of product in the same market to different distributors. Between our, our five stores in 2018, we uh, sold to 2,500 trade customers. Um, and those 2,500 trade customers purchased nearly 100,000 units of compound. Um, so to be doing that for such a long time as we have been, um, you know, helps give us credibility out there in the industry that our products are quality, our products are good, um, our pricing is fair and our service is even better.